It is from the town of Saginaw that I have strayed away, and I landed in a town called Clare about eleven o'clock next day. And it being so stumpy, I thought it next to hell, and I jumped on board of Stanley's coach and went to Isabel. And after dinner was over, I thought I'd take a tram. Sure, I arrived about supper time way out at Turner's camp. Away out in the wild woods where I had no time to shirk. And early the next morning they sent me out to work. It's first they sent me sawing, and they found that would not pay. And then they sent me loading, a loading a danged old sleigh. The loading of this danged old sleigh, I being so awful green, a rolling up the top log before I never seen. Our teamster being in a hurry, for to get o'er his road, twas roll a log and turn a log and camp a log about. And when the last log was on the sleigh to the river he would go, and the way he made his horses get, I'll tell you, was no way slow. You ought to see him drive them, you'd swear that he was drunk. He was never knowing to run the trip without hanging on the stump. And when the last log was off the sleighs to the shanty he would go, and some would talk of curious things that happened long ago. And more would sharp and file their saws while others grind their eggs. And more would mend and patch their shirts and hunt their lousy bags. Oh, the 17th of March rolled round and the weather getting fine. The teamsters quit their hauling, the boys they get their time. The teamsters quit their hauling and the birds began to sing. The boys broke down the rollway, so I guess that it must be spring. Now the winter it's all over and the hard work is all done. We'll all go down to Sagna and have a little fun. Some will go on Stanley's coach and others takes the train. But if you get there before me, you can hoof her up, Liza Jane.